Hey everybody, how's it going? We just got done with all the seven islands. So very quickly, we need to go to Celio here and give him the sapphire. So we handed the sapphire to Celio. So this is the gem that forms a pair with the ruby. Red, you've gone through a lot to get this, didn't you? You don't have to tell me. I know it wasn't easy. Thank you so much. Now it's my turn to work for you. Give me a little time. Okay, this is good. I did it! I linked up with Lynette! Red, red, I did it! I managed to link up with trainers in the Hoenn region! Finally, the network machine is fully operational. Red, I owe it all to you. Thanks to you, my dream came true. I'm not crying. It's enough about me, Red. You're going to keep looking for exotic Pokemon, right? I wish you the best of luck. Okay, so now we can get Hoenn Pokemon, um, which is pretty cool. Although we can't encounter any of them in this game, um, that is something we can do. Um, let's go back to Vermilion. And now, um, you guys know where we're going. To the last technically new place in the game, which is Cerulean Cave, which is in um, Cerulean City. Let's go ahead and run over there. Um, there is no new Pokemon to catch here except the one, which is the Legendary. Um, there is technically one uh, exotic Pokemon, which is Wubbuffet, but we already have a Wubbuffet, so really um, we don't need that. Um, so, we are just going to be repelling throughout the entire cave because, once again, I just I don't really need any of these Pokemon. Now, Cerulean is a great place to um, train, which is really nice, and I'll probably end up training here to basically get Starmie to 100 and do a couple of other things. Um, but let's definitely use some repels. I don't really need to, um, once again, I don't need to encounter any Pokemon. There isn't anything rare or new in here for me. Um, and speaking of Pokedex, I think once we catch this Pokemon, I think we're going to finish it. But we'll see at the end here. Um, so yes, let's go ahead and run around and see where we need to go. Um, I don't know this map. Or I don't know this cave, so um, this quite is this is quite random to me too. I don't really know where to go. Okay, so good thing we brought Radicate and Machamp with us here, because I would have totally not gotten this. Okay, we found a full restore. Okay, well we used about 25 of those uh, getting through the single mode at the trainer tower so that is definitely appreciated you know I sat here thinking I have like 300k dude I got hella money dude I literally like blew through it all okay another full restore which I will once again gladly take um can I grab this item over here a max elixir now those are expensive um let's make sure to put another max repel on those max elixirs are very special. I don't know if you can buy them anywhere in the game. Um, I'd have to Google it, but they're very good. Okay, an Ultra Ball, which is 1,200. So hey, um, money is money. Okay, I have a few places to go here. Let's, I guess, try each of them. Okay, that goes nowhere. That goes... <laughs> I can see that it goes nowhere, you absolute fools. Um, does this absolutely go nowhere and I'm the real fool? Um, okay, let's see what this does. I'm going to break that. That Pokeball is probably the one ladder that I skipped. Unless the game is absolutely trolling me. And this, uh, this is a dead end. Oh lord, the game absolutely trolled me, didn't it? This is just a straight up fake, fake ladder. I wasted a whole repel on a fake ladder. Oh, wowzers, okay. We've been thoroughly bamboozled. Well, I made the mistake of going to the farthest ladder, assuming it's the ladder to get out of here. The game is absolutely toying with me. Okay. Gotta break this. Or, I missed one, and I look like an absolute buffoon. Which, very likely the case also. 
because now all of a sudden I am a little confused and out of options. Oh, I am not confused nor out of options. I forgot about this ladder here. Okay, I don't know where this takes us, but I hope it takes us somewhere nice and lush where I can vacation and have a good time. Okay, that just takes us nowhere. Okay, um, I'm once again confused. Okay, let's go ahead and surf on this water. Um... Okay, <laughs> I don't know where to go. Um, Giggles, I'm in danger. Okay, um, maybe I made a mistake. The place I thought was bad is actually good. So let's, let's retry our route here a little bit. Wait, did we, we didn't go up this, did we? I don't think we went up this. Yeah, so now we go here. Do I surf on that? No. Oh, I see a little Pokemon sticking out. Okay, I don't even have to smash any of those. I can just grab it. Max revive. Some. Oh, repel wore off. Well, then we shall apply another. Okay. Go up here to grab this item. An Ultra Ball. I'll take Ultra Balls. Here's the thing, we don't particularly need them for this Pokemon. Uh, let's go ahead and save. I know we could probably save closer to it, but I'm just not... I'm not taking the chance that I'll accidentally forget. I just don't want to take that chance. Okay, let's save the game. Okay, and again, we're not struggling with this Pokemon. We've got the ball, which I have saved for it. Mew! Why does the Mew look weirdly colored? Why do you look weirdly colored? But that's fine, you too. Um, like I said, I ain't even playing games. I ain't playing no games. I'm throwing the Master Ball at you. I saved it. For you. I think the last Pokemon in our Pokedex. Two. This is nuts. Mew 2 was caught. It was created by scientists after years of horrific gene splicing and DNA engineering experiments. Nope, we're not going to give it, and then let's do the honors. Okay, so our Kanto Dex. Let's go through it, and we will see, and I know this sound is horrible in the ears, but just to show you guys, we have completed the Kanto Pokedex. I think the, the there's only a single Pokemon we don't have, and that's Mew, but Mew is not available. It's, so, it's the 150 Pokemon, and we have every single one of them. So, we have completed our Kanto decks. And then on our National, I think we have a couple. How's our, how, how's our National looking? Let me go all the way past 150. Obviously, we were nowhere near the National decks, but let's just kind of see what we're doing here. And again, wow, that noise is ear splicing. Um... But it's okay. So here's where we get... Okay, so we have a couple of those. And there's a lot of them we still have to evolve to, of course. But we basically got all of them that we could. Um, through Catching from the Islands. Except the Fire Red Exclusives, but I can get that later. Um, but anyway. Let's get ahead and go to the bag. Um, I want to use an Escape Rope. Um, but this is not done. We've technically still got one more Legendary now to get. Um, because now we can capture a legendary beast. Okay, so now we have to look for the final beast. And this is kind of hard to do, but I need a bunch of repels and, um, yes. Now, question, if we go over to, um, Mr. Oak, 
do we get anything for the full Pokedex? Because we finished the Pokedex now. Do we, like, get anything? I guess let's go talk to him. I know there's got to be some prize in this world for finishing it. Good to see you. How's your progress coming along? Here, let me take a look. Um, so 150 and 150 owned. Rating? Your Pokedex is entirely complete. Congratulations. Let's freaking go, dude. And your national dex is 201, 178. I'll be looking forward to seeing you fill the national deck. Bro, do you not get- you're not gonna give me a prize? Let me- cool, there's gotta be a prize. Okay, apparently we don't get anything. Um... Wonderful. Alright, so... I think what we're gonna do now is... Try to look for that beast. And... I feel slightly dumb right now. I probably should have saved my Master Ball for the beast. Because Mewtwo's catchable. The beast runs away. Um... So that was a little dumb. Um, but it's alright. Um, it'll just take a bit more grinding to catch it. Um, no big deal. So, here's what we need. We need a lot of repels. Normal repels. Um, is, do they, do you sell normal repels here? Yes, perfect, you do. Okay, let's buy 42 of them. Okay, so now what we basically need to do is... Um, walk around in grass with the repel on, waiting for the beast to attack us. And the reason that works, well, I guess the reason that works is because it's a legendary, but, um, basically it spawns on one route at a time, and we just basically need to figure out what route it's on, right? So, we enter route six, and we need to go down to the repels. We should be able to encounter it, even though we can't encounter anything else. And if we don't find it in one repel's time, then likely it's at a different route. So we step out and step back in and do it again. So I'm going to do that until we find the beast. Okay. Likely now it's not in this grass. So I'm going to step out, step back in. Hey everybody. So just a quick update. I'm still looking for the legendary uh, beast. I'm having a really hard time finding it for some reason. Um... I did a few different things, um, you know, trying to use a Machamp at 42 instead of my Starmie. I'm using Repels. I'm just having a really hard time finding it. Um, but I did do something to make it easy. Or, a lot easier, actually. Um, partly just because I don't feel like encountering it and spending the next seven hours finding it over and over again. You guys know I have my Fire Red copy. That's the one that we've been trading from this entire time. Well, I went ahead and actually grabbed the Master Ball from um, that copy, um, so now I have another Master Ball. Um, and once again, I just want to emphasize it, um, it's not cheating in any sense because I actually did get that Master Ball completely fairly. I played through my Fire Red copy completely offline, but I did play through it legitimately. So, um, all those Pokemon are legit, all the items are legit. So, I did take another Master Ball from my other account, um, but it is a completely legit account. Um, I just do not want to encounter this, uh, the, the Legendary Beast. I think I'm getting Raikou, and I, it's going to run, for sure. And I just don't want to spend the next couple hours accidentally killing it, not killing it, having it run away. I'm just not going to deal with that. Um, but what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and maybe try a little new strategy. I heard Fuchsia City is good for maybe doing it. I mean, really, it's any piece of grass that you find works pretty well. Um, but anyway, I'm just letting you guys know, I, um, I do have another Master Ball now. Kind of dumb, I probably shouldn't use that on YouTube, but it's alright. Um, like I said, I just grabbed the other one from another legit account. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Um. Oh. Why isn't... Here we go. Okay, um... I'm, like, watching the office highlights on one screen, running around. That took a long time. Like, I watched a lot of tutorial videos, and they see all seem to have found it very, very easily. I didn't have that luck. A lot of people said you need, like, 10 max repels. Well, I've used close to 30, and then 
I think I'm on like 20 normal repels now, so like... Anyway, uh, we can go ahead and like I said, I got the, I got another Master Ball. I ain't playing with it. I'm not playing no games. You're gonna stay in that ball and you're gonna like it. I am not gonna follow this Raikou around the world. You are mine. The rain clouds it carries let it fire thunderbolts at will. They say that it descends with lightning. Nope. Alright, here we go. Legendary Beast has been accomplished. Um, so that's kind of all we have to do. Um, now, literally the only thing left is to go re-challenge the, the Elite Four. So what we're going to go ahead and do, um, I'm going to get my party ready. I'm going to train them up. And then we'll go fight the Elite Four next episode. Okay, guys, so I think I've officially kind of decided what party I want to go into. Um, the, basically, the rematch battle. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and we're going to have Starmie as our lead, like always. Um, backed up by Nidoking. Backed up by Pidgeot. Backed up by Dragonite. Backed up by Mewtwo, which is a new addition here. But come on, guys, this is Mewtwo. I mean, it's Mewtwo or Chansey. Um, yeah, that's an easy choice. And then lastly, I had one more spot, and I'm like, who do I pick? Well, obviously, Tyranitar, right? I mean, um, yeah, so Pupitar Evolution level. What level do we need to get it to? We need to get it to 55, so basically just like Dragonite. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to head into the Cerulean Cave, and I'm going to get uh, Tyranitar first. And then I'm also probably going to level up Pidgey at Needle King. Um, basically, I'm going ham for a little while. I'm going to go and start training. Um, it's going to take a little bit. But, um... Um, we just hit level 30, so Larvitar should theoretically turn in to Pupitar. And as I see, theoretically, it's literally happening, so really not that theoretic, more of a fact. Y'all know what's going on. Got ourselves a Pupitar, that's pretty sick. Alright, and hopefully, we get the Pupitar into a Tyranitar, so back to grinding.
Okay, everybody, so, um, I'm here grinding away. Look at that, Pupitar, level 55, so... Yep, if I was correct, we got, um... We got a Tyranitar, which is super, super sick. Um, and something that I started doing, um, in between training, I realized I just had a bunch of Pokemon with me that weren't getting trained actively. That's a really weird looking Tyranitar. So I decided to replace the rest of my team with Meowths so they can at least pick up items while I'm fighting. And that way we can get a few extra rare candy along the way, you know? Um, so actually let's go ahead and take some items off of here. Um, Spell Unberry, TM10. Okay, but anyway, what we can actually do, we do have some rare candy kind of lying around. Let's go ahead and use that on... Where is OPP up? Let's go ahead and use that on Starmie, go ahead and get some more Psychic going. Um, where's my... where's my candy though? Rare candy, we got five. Hmm. Maybe I'll wait until level 95, because... They're kind of, yeah. Or until I get more. Okay, everybody, I think I've done enough training, and I'm also a little tired here again. Um, but I think I've done enough, because really, my, my main objective is kind of done now, which I'll show you guys. So here's what we got. Level 94 Starmie, um, Tyranitar, Dragonite, Nidoking, all 55, Mewtwo 70, and Pidgeot 47. So what we're going to do here is go ahead and feed these rare candies and I got a couple more of them from the Meowths and we're gonna go ahead and get Starmie up to a hundred and then I don't, I don't know how many I'll have left um, but either way let's go get Starmie to a hundred and then we'll probably um, give the rest to Pidgeot I think we'll only have one left, so I guess it won't really matter, but... Okay, there we go, and Starmie is maxed out at level 100. So we can see, I cannot give it to Starmie. So, we're gonna go ahead and give this one to Pidgeot. Get Pidgeot to level 48 here. Wants to learn agility, okay, well, no, we don't need agility. Um, yes. So, we are finally going to take on the League. We're gonna go ahead and give Pidgeot also the XP share here, give, so we can get Pidgeot probably to level 50, um, before we actually get into that Hall of Fame. But we're gonna go ahead and do that fight next episode, we are done for this episode, so guys, um, I appreciate you guys watching, we're almost at the end of the game here, let's, uh, let's, uh, make it a good one.